More help is on the way for Dayton businesses impacted by COVID-19. Today, the Dayton Area Chamber of Commerce and Downtown Dayton Partnership announced the Reopen Downtown Dayton Grants. Two News reporter Deborah Bogart shares one business's story of how this will help them during the coronavirus. The owner of the Brightside Music and Event Venue says the application process is one of the easiest and most streamlined processes she's seen. And she says she's so thankful for a community right now that is backing local businesses. The Brightside normally sees three to four events a week, from weddings to wrestling matches. But their last event was March 10th, so they're going to have to get creative to reopen responsibly. Possibly utilizing a projector in our parking lot, possibly an FM uh, transmitter so we can maybe put things into people's stereos in their car and do something that's more of a drive up experience. Picture like a wedding that's a drive in movie. The venue owner, Carly Dixon, says before they can do that, they have to keep their light on. So she was thrilled to apply today for the reopen downtown Dayton grant. Everybody's trying in every way that they can to help us. Um, and those efforts are valiant and we are grateful. But if they don't help you at the end, they don't help you. When your local community speaks to you as an individual, it does mean a lot. And it is the difference with whether or not a year from now we're, we're still standing or not. The grants range from two to $10,000 and was kickstarted by a $500,000 donation from the CareSource Foundation. Thursday morning, Chris Kirshner with the Dayton Area Chamber of Commerce told Two News Today anchor John Seibel, it's vital that they do what they can to help small businesses reopen and bring vibrancy back to Dayton. We have almost $700,000 that we're going to be able to grant out to these small businesses in downtown Dayton. All they have to do, John, is just go to reopendayton.com. All the information is on that website. The deadline for business owners to apply for the grants is Friday, May 22nd. Reporting in Dayton, Deborah Bogart, 2 News, working for you.